came over and uh, we convoys uh, taking the convoys across England from from England to, to France. Mm -hmm. That's where they landed in D Day, eh? So we used to go back and forth every day. You know, we left England and go over to France and come back. Left England, go back. That's where every day we go over there. What was the hardest part about being away so long? Hmm? Was it hard being away so long? Well, I, I got home once. That's the five and a half years. We, 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 we went to the States, the States got into war, but we had to go in St. John's and fuel up. And the captain said, no, but we'll go out ashore, come, come back till tomorrow morning. So, well, I got, <laughs> they got hard as leave. I went, went down the next morning, the ship was gone. I went up on the street, met the patrol, and told them what happened. You were in trouble, he said. I said, that's it, I, I, not my fault. Anyway, I went down. The captain sent a, a, a message. said, Bull receives all night leave. He, he, he returns in 24 hours. Please give him 14 days leave. So, I came home. I got the mumps. <laughs> <laughs> While you were home. Yeah. Anyway, I went back. Passed me ship. He said, you were into trouble. What do you mean in trouble? He said, you were adrift. I said, no, I'm not. I passed the slip from the doctor. <laughs> then I joined the, the Canadian Corvette. I went to Halifax. I got on the train there and went down to the States and joined, joined my ship. And, and what about when you got home in 1946? How did that feel? Well, I got home Christmas Eve. That's good timing. I never got no sleep that night, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> How about since then? Well, that's all my... Uh... Yeah. You certainly lived a full life. You know, I was on that tower for, for, for seven years. And when the post office came out, I applied with the post office and got the post office. Mm -hmm. I was in the post office seven, 17 years. When I got 60 years old, I said to her, I said, I, I'm quitting. She said, I think you yelled out for me. <laughs> she went that. I hired a boat and engine and five gills that went fishing. <laughs> and how long did you do that? I made, I made more money one day than I made. <laughs> <laughs> did you enjoy it? Did you enjoy fishing? Oh, yeah, yeah. And when did you give that up? I was fishing for seven, seven or eight years. That's the magic her name is. Beautiful. Fifty-four tons. Wow. First year we were down, we got home. We left that never. We never left our home before the tenth of June. We got back again sometime, but twenty-third of July was thousand calories. 